Hi guys, it's Thomas here. Welcome back to the channel. Today I want to walk you through my new Notion template called uh, Eventflow, which is a professional operating system for event management. So it's for anyone whose daily job is to organize different types of events, you know, be it weddings, corporate events, or really any kind of event. And uh, I've built this uh, simple template for sort of like being able to professionally manage uh, different aspects of of running and organizing uh, events in any kind of setting. So let me first show you how the dashboard of the template looks like. So as you can see um, on the left we have the navigation panel which uh, gives you quick access to all of the items uh, and databases that are included uh, in the template. Then we have add new so you can add a new event new task new vendor and uh, new venue and then uh, the rest of the dashboard is dedicated to being able to see all your active events which are going on which uh, you can have a sneak peek uh, here then we have uh, top rated vendors and uh, venues which give you a quick access to uh, obviously vendors and venues that you have in your uh, databases and then on the right we have uh, open tasks uh, across all events so you can quickly see all the tasks that are related to uh, these uh, these active uh, active events uh, to explain the logic of um, of uh, event flow so basically we have um, uh, three databases which uh, which are venues vendors and guest lists and these uh, these are basically things that you can build up uh, over time so uh, just to give you an example <clears throat> imagine the the vendor list so uh, as you go by you will be building up your vendor list and um, there will be multiple names and companies here which you have uh, previous experience with so this database is a simple table which enables you to add all of these uh, all of the vendors in one place and then once you will be working on a new uh, new event in any time you can link these vendors uh, and use them in that uh, particular event so uh, as you can see here uh, i mean it's a it's a pretty simple uh, database where you can you can track different uh, different things like you know being able to rate the vendor take some notes uh, link them to the event of course add images if necessary, add contact contact uh, contact details, uh, uh, add service service area, etc. But this is a great kind of way to uh, store all the data related to vendors, and the same goes for uh, for for venues, right? So so and with the same logic, there's gonna be a list of venues that you've historically worked with and that you want to keep uh, track of stuff like capacity, price range, your subjective rating, contacts, location, photos, of course, uh, etc. So these uh, vendors and venue databases are kind of static. They are there and they can be linked to, to any, any new event. And to give you an, uh, uh, a showcase of how uh, an event, uh, event looks like. So let's open up, for example, this one. And what we will have here is again like a bunch of uh, parameters, nodes, <clears throat> days to go, uh, vendors, venues, which are all these like linked uh, linked properties, guest lists, the same. Uh, we will have uh, total total budget that is dedicated to the event that uh, that we can track here, and also we can track actual spend. And then what's what's important is going to the to the event uh, detail page, right? So there's a placeholder for nodes, uh, which you can, you know, either write directly here, or you can very simply create new sub pages for uh, dedicated to note taking. And then what we will have here is um, uh, the tasks. Uh, so all the tasks uh, that are that are dedicated to this particular event uh, can and will be will be tracked here. Then we will have uh, expenses, right? So any expenses that comes through either either planned or actually paid off uh, goes here. And what you can also see here is that uh, there are simple charts here that uh, 
that you can you can adjust it as you need but basically uh, uh to get you going there's the plan budget which is which is a collection of all the planned uh, expenses and there is uh, then actual expenses which uh, of course uh, show you the overall actual spent expense so far on on the event so we have uh, task tracking we have expense tracking and then we have vendors and venues and as i've explained before these are linked to uh, these are linked from their respective uh, respe respective uh, uh, databases and are shown here for quick access so you can kind of very quickly have this all in one place and you can see that for a particular event you know these are the these are the tasks these are the expenses these are the vendors contracted uh, these are the venue venue or venues for that particular event and the last item here is a guest list uh, so you can uh, you can basically build up your guest list for the event you can track the rsvp status um and bunch of other other details about the guests like you know plus ones seating contact details etc etc whatever whatever you need so anytime you create or decide to run a new event this is where all the data uh, about the event and all the all the things all the nodes all the tasks all the expenses and everything is basically tracked in this one a neat uh, neat page uh, so so this is basically uh, basically it uh, if you need a bit more depth into uh, how to how to set up these uh, events here or, or how this uh, template works uh, uh, please do get in touch and i'll be happy to explain but this is really the the logic of the operating system for professional event planners uh, to have all the things that you build up basically the, the knowledge that you build up over about your venues and vendors in one place and then have everything regarding a one event in one dedicated page when where everything uh, basically kind of comes uh, together so if you like this template you can check it out uh, in the description of the video below and if you are a um, event manager running events and you like this please uh, don't hesitate to get in touch with any questions or ideas about improvements for this template because it's uh, obviously super super helpful to hear feedback from you guys how you work and if you would find a template like this helpful so thank you very much for checking this uh, short video out i hope you have a great day and i'll see you in the next one